How's it going everybody? Schaefer here and today we're going to be starting our playthrough of Rise of the Ronin. This has been on my backlog, pile of shame, whatever you want to call it, for quite some time. Uh, so I figured I'd just jump in now and, and get started. So I think with that out of the way, let's just get into it. Enjoy. Uh, let's check the options here, so anything we want to know. I think we set this up when I turned it on. Uh, yeah, it's fine, I guess. <laughs> Visuals prioritize graphics, let's see how that works out. Blush and blur is still off, that's great. Okay, good. New game, let's do it. I don't know if there's a difficulty. Ah, there is. Twilight. For those confident in their skills, you can change difficulty after starting the game. Yes. Rise of the Vote Ronin is a fictional story that takes inspiration from a time... ...something something in Japan. <laughs> Three centuries ago, Japan was unified under the Tokugawa Shogunate. It closed its doors to the rest of the world, and for a time the island nation prospered. Yet despite its apparent tranquility, conflict brewed beneath the surface. Feudal lords known as Daimyo were kept under strict surveillance. In public, they were loyal. But the coals of discontent were slowly being fanned towards conflagration. In the mountains of Kurosu, weapons were secretly forged in preparation for rebellion. But the Shogun's forces got wind of the plan and took terrible and bloody reprisals. The Veiled Edge. Skilled in both subterfuge and the way of the sword, these nameless assassins were unmatched in their abilities. Under the tutelage of a master, the Blade, they honed their skills in pairs called Blade Twins. Go! Separately, formidable. Together, unstoppable. Blade twins are forever tied together by the bonds of fate. Here we go. Changing a butter type will be deleting the current. Oh, uh, yeah, fine. I haven't really done anything. Ah, okay, okay, okay. Elbow and knee angle. I mean. <laughs> Where we have like really weird, like really wide elbows. Stance weapons sh sheathed. Well, with the weapons sheathed, that, that's fine. I mean, it's hard to tell what that's even doing. And then a boogie in with my elbows, I mean, uh, and my knees. 
<laughs> I mean, I don't really see what it's doing. I mean, whatever, it's just zero, I guess, right? Skin color, gotta be... That's fine. Underwear type. Well, I mean, I can't even see it, so what do you... Uh, it would, like, what do you... What do you mean? I mean, I... Can I hide the clothes? Aha! Aha! There it is! Alright, okay. I mean, you know. Underwear color, hey, no kidding. Give us some... What do you reckon? But, wait a minute, wait a minute. Like, I can't change the color of the top one? It's just... It's just the bottom one I can change the color. Really? Well, then in which case you may as well leave it as white, otherwise it looks weird. Well, I think it... <laughs> I mean, at least it... I think it looks weird. Can I not, like... Uh, yeah, I mean... I may as well leave them both white. I mean, it makes more sense that way now, right? Ah, wow. Okay, there's full, there's full customization. I didn't realize that. Irises and pupils. Can I, um... There we go. Get a proper look at them. Not to... That's the standard, I think. Not very clear, you know? Uh, it's not very, like, bright. It's hard for me to, um... I think I like this one. Color should we give? Oh, the green looks great. Oh, the blue looks good too. Yes, there it is. Perfect. I mean, generally speaking, most of it looks fine. I mean, we can be kind of boring here and just kind of roll with the, uh... It's like a, um... Ah, there we go. I was going to say, it's like a preset. This, uh, this I love, right? Something really simple here that I don't really see a lot in games is... I can hold R1 to compare it to the original. So yeah, just tap R1, it shows me what it looks like currently, the current selected one. That's such a subtle yet great feature to have, right? Because there's so many times you're, you're building a character and you're not quite sure what you... If you like to compare to the previous. And here I can just be like, oh, okay, I'll just compare and see what it looks like. And it's, it's fantastic. See now, because I like this chin because it's not as pointy, so I definitely like that more. I like this one better. I like that one too. And yeah, I, I like I like this one. I think that's good. Awesome. I don't. I'm not going to change anything. I think that's fine. Uh, I might change the eyebrows though. Give her a monobrow. A uni sorry, unibrow. Monobrow? Monobrow. Whatever. <laughs> Whatever it's called. I don't know.
Yeah, I think I prefer that one. Eyebrow color, I mean... Oh, it's just white, jeez, that looks weird. Yeah, I mean, we'll leave it to black. I think that's fine. Yeah, 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 that's good. Eyes, I mean, everything else I'm kind of okay with. Oh, hang on, let me, we could do eye shape. Hmm, I do kind of like this one actually better. That one's nice too. I'm using it all the time. I'm using the compare the previous appearance all the time. It's fantastic. What an amazing feature to have, you know? I think I like that one. Do I like this one? Yeah, 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 yeah. I like this one. We did this, nose, mouth, teeth, ears, I think are fine. Teeth are fine. Facial hair. No, I think we're... I think we're good on the old uh, facial hair. I like this one. Looks a little, looks a little mad scientist. Oh, I got quite a few. I like this one. Very traditional. There we go. I think I had this one. Uh, I think I had this. You can tell it's <laughs> this type of game is similar to Neo, I guess, right? I remember I, I made one of my Neo characters um, had this style of hair. So I love it. I love the way it's like. Um, it kind of reminds me of like a. What's the, what's, the, what's the game I'm thinking of? Oh, no, it's not a game. It's an... Ah, completely lost. Oh, it looks like a Dragon Ball kind of style hair, right? Something you'd see in, in Dragon Ball. Like Super Saiyan 3 or something, you know? It just needs a bit more hair at the back. I think it looks great. Yeah, that one's quite nice, too. That one's that one I like too. Ooh, I like this one. That, that kind of the straight back. Uh, that one too, which do I prefer. What is this? <laughs> what is this? Okay. Oh, it's a hat. There's a hat on her head. I was like, how did you even st Wait, is it a hat? I have, is that hair or hat? I think that might be hair. How do you style that hair? But that's got to be a lot of, like, hairspray, right? There's no way that's staying that way. Oh, yeah, here it is. <laughs> the afro, very nice. That's, that's kind of nice, too, actually. Oh, they've got some good ones. Here we go, another kind of mad scientist-looking one. That one looks kind of cool, too. Ah, there's a few I like here, actually. Yeah, I think I like that one better. Yeah, I think I'm going to stick with... This one, because otherwise it would be this one, and we go, we go full crazy. Bangs, hair tied. Oh, bangs, hair tied, hair at sides, tied hair top, upper rear, lower rear. Oh my god, what the hell? 
So which options do I get for that one? Like, let's see if I pick... Oh, I can have bangs. Oh, cool. Oh, well, that changes it completely, because now you can add a fringe and stuff. Do I prefer it straight or curly? I think straight. Tips. Because why would we not want to color the tips? Oh, kind of like, kind of like where we go in here. Tip color range. I was like, oh, is that like more or less of the tips, huh? Currently a five. Call me a little bit crazy, but can't really see a difference. Oh, we can we can really have she has like this, this hairstyle is nightmare fuel for anybody that wants to actually do it for her. I have this hair with the tips different colored. <laughs> then I have like these highlights with other colors in them. And it's like, you must be an absolute nightmare to, to style for. Gray hair? I don't want gray hair. Are you kidding me? Now the gray. Love it. Perfect. Oh, hey, look at that. Curliness. Game, I, I, I just, I can't. How much are we going to do here? This is nuts. Lots of customization, which is nice. I think it's all max length, that's fine. Accessory color? I don't have any accessories. Yeah, 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 yeah. I think we're happy. Facial hair. Give her a mustache. No, I think we're good. Kind of like this one. This one too. We go for a more subtle one, huh? Oops. Okay, just like fa almost face paint style here. I'm gonna take it off, actually. I mean, that's so, it's so minute, it's super hard to see. They're just slightly longer on this one, I think, basically. Does 
Does this make it... Okay, that makes it very obvious. Okay, good. Is that too much? Yeah, we'll leave that off. It's off at the moment. Face paint? Oh, uh, hello. <laughs> Oh, that's a very bright, damn. The funny thing is, there's no customization. That is literally it. Oh, ew, she looks very ill here. Okay, you know what? Let's let's take let's leave that off. Not nail polish, hey guys. A toenail polish. What's going on? We'd have matching toes, right? Yes or no? I feel like yes. Facial markings. Face, face paint is what I thought I thought this would be. I thought we'd get like some, you know, you know, markings we could put on. No problem. It's like, no, it just literally covers your face in in, in, in a paint. Uh, it's just kind of nuts. Wait, where is this? I don't understand where this is going. Game? Where, where, where's... This is... Facial markings. Oh, 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 there we go, there we go. Wow, that looks scary, huh? This looks like the, uh, the, the mummy, the newest movie, The Mummy, where she has, like, all of her... Like, all these runes all over their faces. This is kind of terrified, too. I don't understand. These ones aren't appearing anywhere. Where, where, where are these? Oh, <laughs> it's not it's not right on my nose, as you can see. Right there, I got you. Let's give her like a a, a two B styled. Wait, which side of the face is it on again? Damn it! You hold up, hold up. It's on the other side of the face. How did I forget that? Am I a real fan? I don't know. Questionable. Make it a bit smaller. I don't want it to have a shine. I was hoping to make it to yeah, the teensy weensy a little bit smaller. It's also kind of a weird. Is it just a weird shape because it's on a part of the, the face that looks weird, or is it... Yeah, I was gonna say, I'm pretty sure it's a circle. I don't think it's gonna really make much difference how I rotate it. Oh, we can't just... There we go. I can't just decide. So, okay, hang on. Let's just make it... Ah, uh, it's very a bit too small. It's not up to 23. Nah, 20. There we go. Perfect. Alrighty. Facial marking too. Can we just have more? We can just have more. Ah, it's under my fringe. Yeah, let me show you. Boom. <laughs> right on the forehead. That's why we couldn't see it before, because it was right on the forehead. Okay, these are interesting things to have on my face, especially the forehead. Again, that is kind of terrifying. These these are wild. These ones are insane. Oh, we could be Harry Potter. All right, no, I think we think we're good. Give her some. No, we don't want to give her. There we go. Give her some hair back. 
height, head size. I'm kind of okay with it, but as it is, we can be like super skinny. That just makes me wider, doesn't it? Yeah, that literally just makes me wider. Okay. Muscle mass. Oh, nice. How do we have negative muscle mass? How does that work? Wait, hold on. Let me, let me use the compare button. Oh, okay, okay. So she just lose ever so slight definition here and there. Not much. Oh, oh, oh. This is a super important option. Okay, great. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, hello. I mean, I think it goes without saying this is the most... This is this has to be it, right? Body markings. Oh, I can have the same on my body too. Okay, cool. They're just much bigger. Oh, hang on. We have some more options. Ooh, a fish. Oh, this looks pretty cool. A frog. Yeah, I like the frog. We could put something on our back, right? Hang on. Hang on. There we go. Uh, wait, hold up. I'm going to have to rotate whatever it is around. Uh, what are we going to pick? Let's find something here that's cool. Like this. Ah, there we go. Oh, that's easy. Super nice for that. can just kind of throw it straight onto the back without having to worry too much about it. I, oh, it won't let me zoom. It's as, as zoomed in as we're getting. That's a shame. I can't really see it very well. Mm, I mean... Eh, it's okay, right? Is that a snake? It's a snake. Oh, that's super handy. So it also does the arms too. That's cool. I like that. It looks a little warped. Hmm. Yeah, I mean, it's okay. I'm not hugely blown away. Put it right on the outside of the elbow. It sucks to have them there. <laughs> there, boom. I would, like, I would like to zoom in a little bit more. I'd like to see it a bit clearer. I mean, some of these are okay. I don't know if I want any of them, though. Hmm. Oh. Interesting. That is a... Those are back pieces only, huh? Interesting, is that a chest piece only? Looks like it's a chest piece only and you can oh, you can't move it at all. It's just stuck there. It looks a bit it looks a bit stretched, you know? It looks like it's sort of Yeah, it looks like it's stretched out. The proportion doesn't look right. The problem is, hey, look, you can see, it starts to wear off, so you have only limited space upwards. Yeah, before you, you really start to lose track of it, unfortunately. Oh, 
Oh, it's only on the is it only on the outer arm? Oh no, there we go. Does start to disappear though, look at that. That's a shame. It kind of finishes right there. It's a bit weird. Yeah, I don't know. I don't know about this. I don't think there's anything. I think I'm just going to go with none. I think we're just going to have none here. Can't really decide on anything I like the look of, so... Lower body markings. They're all the same, huh? We go. We can put it right there. Oh, now that's kind of nice, though. Yeah, you can kind of have it wrapping around, you see? It's kind of nice. I would just max the size of it out. Hey, you know what? That's not terrible. Problem is when I look at the when I look at the the arms. Oh, you could put multiple ones on, right? Oh no, I can't. I'm limited to the wrap around, aren't I? Yeah. Sorry, that's making it bigger. That's the wrong option. No, I don't think I like it as much. Thing. I think I quite like it like this. Then tattoo. Oh my word. Okay. Wait, so that's not considered a tattoo? Okay. If you, I mean, if you say so. Okay, cool. 
What even is... Like, what even is it? I can't even really tell what it is. Oh, is it a fish? Or a, a couple of fish? Oh, weird. It's a shame the only one on uh, tattoo is this one, and I can't even tell what's really look uh, what it really is. Hey, this is two arms. I mean, it's nice, nicer. I think I can actually see what's what it what it is at least, right? I'd kind of like this to just be one arm, though. Yeah, I mean, I can barely see what that is. That's kind of meh. I find it hard that like, the body markings are not considered. You know. You give a really gnarly scar right there. Look at that. Boom. That's I'm taking forever with this, but you know, it, artwork takes time. Maybe if I could put it more on the shoulder here. But unfortunately, it starts to fade out a little bit. Yeah. Wow, that looks horrible because it kind of... See what I mean? So that's to like stretch the uh it starts to stretch the design out. And so it looks a bit weird. I mean, I think zero is supposed to be in the middle of the arm, right? But I mean, it looks like... It looks off. Yeah, I mean, I think... I mean, well, to be fair, I think, don't think the design is... Yeah, it's not an even design, is it? Like, there's... The petals at the bottom, or at least it looks like petals at the bottom, are longer than they are at the top. How small can we make this? Oh wait, let me go the other way. And 
No, no, not that small. It's actually still pretty ridiculously big. Yeah, even when I shrink it. Yes, we have some circles <laughs> on on our elbow. I don't really know why we would do that, but you know, uh, it, it is what it is. I don't know. I don't think I could find anything else that I really like that sort of sits very well. The one on the leg looks decent enough because it's wrapped around. Yeah, I mean, I think the front, I think the front one's okay, right? Well, what do we think? I think it looks okay. Yeah, screw it. It's fine. Uh, a body, oh, just done this. Right. Yes. Voice. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Ah. Uh. Let's go. 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 Oh. Let's go. 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 Oh, I'll be honest, I don't like either of these. Let's go. Let's go. Don't mess up. The two of us are one. Don't forget this. Let's go. Don't mess up. Let's go. Don't mess up. Let's go. Don't mess up. Th I think that one. The two of us are one. Don't. Let's go. Don't mess up. The two of us are one. D Let's go. Don't mess up. The two of us are one. D Let's go. Don't mess up. The two of us are one. All right. Let's let's go with this one. Uh, save. Temporary data, I guess. Uh, call it the first one. All right. Yeah, after all this, I smacked the randomizer. That'd be a great idea. All right. Uh, no, I don't want to discard. I'm done. How do I confirm? Um. Okay, okay. Help? Oh, oh, finalized settings. Uh, it is this one. There we go. No, wait. Oh, wait. Oh, uh. Veiled Edge 1 and Veiled Edge 2. Wait a minute. Do I have to create two characters? Oh, no. <laughs> now we look like now we're twins. Fabulous. So we're going to change the hair. 
This is nuts. Okay, all right. Make it really complicated by making me do like this twice game. We will go with this one. We'll go with a slightly different color. Very nice. Color tips, I like that. We won't have any highlights for this one. Yeah. Yeah, I'm a Add that in. I don't know why I need two, but uh, we're doing two, apparently. Lipstick's fine again. I think we're just going to pick a different color, though. Lovely. Obviously, we're going to have different nail polish. Wait, what color was it before? Was this color before? Okay. Oops. Oops. Obviously, we have to have the toes. And they have to match. We'll remove the marking. Ah, uh, face. That's all fine. How do we do the... Ah, here we go. We'll use a different preset as well. Eyes we've done, huh?
Mm. That's fine. Oh, I didn't realize there was such a preset for the mouths and stuff and the noses. Damn. Okay, a little bit taller, give her a little bit more body mass, body muscle mass, sorry. And we'll give her type one, I guess. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Don't mess up. The two of us are one. <laughs> yeah, no, the, the pitch completely destroys this one. We'll call us one second. <laughs> I guess. Yeah, I think I like that subtle change to the nose. Do I like it better like this, or like this? I think I like it like that. Give her those elf looking ears. That's cool. Alright, awesome. I think we're done, right? Yeah. Oh, overwrite, yes. Still cold first. <laughs> there we go. Cool. Okay, so... Proceed with these characters. Yes. I don't know why I had to set up two. Whatever. As a swordsmith... As a swordsmith polishes a blade, 
so too does a bladesmith sharpen the veiled edges in their charge. Choose a blade sharpening origin to determine the veiled edges' initial abilities and special skills, as well as the weapons with which they excel. Oh, okay. Wool. <clears throat> oh, a seducer. Uh, unsharpened. What is this like? A like a a Dark Souls starting origin, where it's like a, what is it like the the wretch, a weakling whose ineptness has resulted in their lack of a blade sharpening origin. These veiled edges only know. Uh, sorry, these veiled edges know only the most basic skills, and have poor attributes to boot. Their ability to survive in a cruel world such as ours is surely to survive. It's surely a sign of their inordinate look. In uh, in quotes. So, okay. Oh, is that a pistol? Is that like rifles there? Or, 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 or? Learn the art of ninjutsu. To compete, uh, to complete highly dangerous missions, trained in utilizing various equipment, and can assassinate multiple enemies at once. Ah. Learn the art of being charismatic and charming. Efficient and practiced movements allowed for efficient key usage, and you'll be able to also be, uh, and you will also be very clever with words to deceive people. Wide range of knowledge required for a spy. Adept at handling firearms and medical practice. Also excels at negotiations. I like the seducer idea. Charismatic and charming, efficient and practiced movements allow for efficient key usage. Using key sounds kind of fun, huh? Right? Yes. How interesting. So what's the dealio here? Do I, do I, which one do I play as? So that'll be it for this episode. If you enjoyed, leave a like, subscribe for more, and I'll see you in the next one.